sorry y'all thought I was recording but I've already opened this mask and put it on my face honey I was just telling you guys that I've had this five and below mask for about a month now and I thought it was super cute because it's Barbie and it's got all the cute Barbies on there and so this mask has some water glycerin some other stuff um coconut oil avocado oil and some other stuff that's difficult to pronounce so you know what that means but anyway i just figured let me check out this cute little pink barbie five and below mask and see what i think um i just put it on my face and yeah it's pink y'all and it smells so freaking good this mask smells like strawberries i just am absolutely loving it i'm back y'all it's been about 15 minutes so i'm gonna take this mask off and it seems okay I mean it, it's y'all the smell it smells really good but if you are really sensitive to like smells it's a nice fruity smell um, you might not like it I will say my face does not have as much product residue normally when i take a mask off i have so much of the residue on my face still that i just pat into my skin this one actually doesn't have much um my skin doesn't feel as soft i mean hey for five dollars it ain't bad but it wouldn't be a repurchase i can't lie um but i just thought it was cute y'all know it was cute with the little barbies on there and everything and it smells good and it's pink but mm, it's a no. <laughs> Y'all, I'm about to do this unboxing, and I'm super excited about it. You know why? Because I don't remember what I got. But to me, that's like the best unboxings when you can't remember what you got, especially when it's a Coach package, honey. So when I got this, I was like, what did I get from Coach that is this small? I don't know. I just honestly don't remember. I know if it's Coach, it's got to be good. And if I ordered it, of course, I like it. Now, y'all, one reason I don't remember is because I've had so many packages come through because I've been doing a lot of shopping for Christmas. And um, I just went through a lot of it today and opened up stuff that I knew was uh, Christmas purchases. So I put those things away and I was like, okay, now let me, let me open some of these other packages that are not um christmas present which i'm about to do <gasps> y'all this looks like it's gonna be so freaking cute so i've got some tiny cute little bag here and i don't even know what it is so of course this is the packaging so let me see what i got y'all this package right here is a sephora box i can't even remember what i got from there maybe sephora maybe Ulta. i don't know one of the one of the two but i can't remember um ooh. <laughs> What is this bag called? I can't even, y'all. Isn't she freaking cute? I think, y'all, this is my first Coach signature print in this color pattern. I always get like the khaki um, Coach color and I have like that dark brown one, but I don't have any like this. I got it on sale. I don't remember how much, but oh my gosh, this is so cute. I think this would be so cute to take on a Saturday like date if hubby and I are going out during the day this is giving me like it's daytime but I still want to be cute and dainty and like not do too much the color is what gives it daytime vibes for me if it were that darker pattern I would take it out more at night but yeah it's so cute I'm about to open it and see like what it's looking like inside I did not get an invoice which I normally do like they were really tripping when they uh, package this and I don't really name the bag so if any of you all remember the name of this bag please uh, let me know I did not even remember this bag had this cute little gold um, chain on part of the strap like this is super cute that gold really just gives it a more fancy look it's real feminine and dainty so let me open her up I think I would like this in that darker 
uh, coach signature print and I would also like this I'm not gonna lie I love a black and gold bag I would also like this in black with that gold hardware I think that that would be perfect to me for date night because I do take a lot of black bags when I go on date night um but yeah so it has this little white coach tag here it's not white it's like an ivory color coach tag it's got the gold hardware of course I already showed you this and inside it's got some bag information y'all so I can tell y'all more about the bag this is what it looks like inside just a little open hole with uh is that two no one little pocket here where you can put cards and stuff which I usually don't I'll probably have some little small wallet type thing y'all Y'all ever get these stuck in your bag and you don't know and you go in and out of stores and the alarm is going off. This has happened to me so many times and mostly with my coach Rowan's it happens. Um, I'm so glad I checked because that is so embarrassing. This is the signature miniature um, PYTN. Is that the Peyton bag? Is that? I think that's what it's called. Anyway, I freaking love her love her so yeah can't wait to wear this bag um yeah i think i can wear this bag on a date night but i don't know she still is giving me i'm going to brunch during the day uh on a saturday or a sunday kind of vibes yeah that's it brunch bag brunch bag right here child and so i'm about to open this uh sephora box she did come from sephora i know there's nothing crazy exciting because i think i just got some stuff i needed to um repurchase that I had run out of so what I got in here y'all oh you know what I got um whatever I chose for my birthday and I don't remember <laughs> which was the oh I think this was the gift so this is the Patrick uh, TA travel size major brow lamination gel and major glow lip shine I think this is what I got as a birthday um gift thingy my birthday was in november so this is either a old purchase that i just had sitting or it came late i don't know which one and then i got oh i guess i've been into like brow gels more and stuff then i got this benefit brow gels called give me brow plus brow volumizing brow volumizing fiber gel and so yeah got that and i always get like smaller sizes because for one i don't know if i'm gonna like something but also if it's a mascara or a brow gel to me the lord the fuller size runs out fat dry the fuller size dries out faster so i usually don't get that what i get from the ordinary looks like i have two things in here from the ordinary a serum multi um peptides serum i don't remember getting this i do like ordinary products though so i'm not mad y'all am i like obsessed with brow gel right now you will not believe what this is this is not a brow gel so apparently i'm obsessed with like brows this is a multi-peptide lash and brow serum oh i think i really got this for lashes because i do like to wear my real lashes and I wanted to put like a serum on them to kind of keep them healthy and and stuff and you know grow them out and all that kind of stuff so looking forward to that what else I got and then I have my fave the famous the ordinary hyaluronic acids I normally get I don't know if this is the only size do y'all know this this is the only size I've ever had, so I don't know, but um, this goes a long way, so it lasts, and, and my skin likes it, so yeah, that's all I got from Sephora. I didn't know what I had, but I'm super excited to try all this brow and lash stuff. And then I just finished my tree, hubby and I did, y'all. We had to cat proof it, honey. So at the top, we just put the regular metal hooks. And then at the bottom, hubby um, used some zip ties. And you see we have the little um, air cans there because 
that deters the cats from coming to that area. They, it only, it, it's not harmful to them. It only sprays out air and they don't like it. It's loud and they run away from it. We have a sandbag here, y'all, because it keeps the cats from kicking over the tree. Didn't put the bed skirt because they're attracted to soft <laughs> blankets. And the one we have is, is very soft blankety material. But yeah, y'all, it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. So yeah, let me show y'all my baby. Some A lot of these trees, I do a very traditional tree with some personal ornaments and just some regular um, Christmas colors. I don't do anything fancy. So here's my baby, Caitlin. We had this ever since she was a baby. She was about um, maybe two on that picture and maybe even a little less, maybe like a year and a half or almost two. That's Caitlin, she is 21 now. And then I have Kennedy here. She is 24 now. She was about three on there. They're three years apart. And then I have my son, Caden. Caden was about six on here. I think he was in first grade when he took that. So yeah, y'all got the tree done. Y'all had to show y'all our Snoop on the shelf. <laughs> Isn't that cute? So yeah, cute little uh, spin on Elf on the shelf. So we got Snoop there, y'all. Hey, Snoop. So I am about to switch into a new bag. I'm excited about wearing this bag. This is a dupe. It's not, you know, the actual thing, but she's super cute. So um, this is the bag that I'll be wearing for the next week. And stay tuned. I might be doing a what's in my bag in her.